So hi, I'm at the EY Center and that's really close to the airport. There's helicopters landing here all the time. So sorry about the noise. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for joining me and see you in a bit. Bye. Oh, good morning everybody. I'm at the EY Center and that's right beside the airport as you can tell, you can tell by the sound of the helicopters landing. Um, I'm in the bus parking zone at the EY Center. You can see it's quite a distance away from the building itself, but there is a path you can take. Now, sometimes we just simply unload in the parking lot and the kids walk. Uh, I've chosen this time to drive to the door and uh, let them off of the door and I park up here. Uh, not a bad choice. Either way works, uh, depending on the situation. Uh, this time we have a lot of, uh, it's, it's staggered, so there is not a really a blockage of buses there, so it works out much better. So thank you very much and uh, here's the map. All right, let's show you how to get to the UI Center. It's not terribly difficult. It's near the airport, okay? So, uh, what we're going to do, um, there's lots of ways of getting there. Um, we could take the Queensway all the way to Bronson, but if it's rush hour, this is slow going, and, you know, you're just wasting your time sitting on the Queensway. So, what I chose to do... Um, I took Ennis and then flipped around onto the 417 eastbound. It's kind of south that way, but it's a, the, the, ma, the signs all say eastbound. And then I got off at um, Hunt Club. And then, again, you've got multiple ways of getting there, but I chose um, Conroy. And it generally works out really well. And Conroy gets me to Davidson. Uh, and Davidson, well, that becomes Leicester. And then it becomes Uplands Drive. And that gets me right there. And I'll show you there. Leicester. And it becomes Uplands. Now, when we get there, okay, we're going to go to satellite. Now, you notice how you know, like the airport is right here. So we're going to get a lot of airport noise. But a lot of the traffic... Um, the buses were going in this way and dropping off and that's not the right way again This is what Google Maps does to you, right? Um, we actually have to go in. I'll show you Really close Notice here we actually have lines for buses the best way to get in there is you drive in This is where you're gonna park, but you're gonna go down and Drop your kids off here. Okay at the entrance after which, then you come out, go back, and you park here. Now, I did see some buses parking here and here, which is okay. Um, but this is where the cars are all parking, okay? And we don't want to mix car and bus traffic together. And I saw some buses coming straight down here and letting off here, which is just not a good idea, okay? Unless it's only buses there which doesn't happen too often. But on the bright side, when it was time to pick up, I just drove straight down, went in, parked, and picked up. Now, because the way it was staggered, um, there was different bus times for different groups. So it, there was not a log jam here. So that worked out really well. If it's, you know, if it's only, only buses doing this, uh, then you can fill this in and then let the kids walk to your bus and then leave but this doesn't happen very often so anyway nice easy place to get to you know um, there is you know of course facilities um, unless it's you know extremely busy the uh, there is not really uh, the cafeteria is not really open okay so you know if you're gonna stick around you know bring a lunch now you there are places nearby that you can go to all right, so thank you very much, and here's the drive.
All right, so the reason I do these videos um, is so that new bus drivers learn how to do these charters. Um, Google Maps is a useful tool, but it doesn't always give you the right way of traveling through these places or where to park. So I try to make these videos so that brand new bus drivers or bus drivers who are just getting into charters learn how to do these charters the right way or a better way. So hopefully, you know, um, you learn from this. But anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. You take care and see you in my bus. Bye.